Another racist scandal emerging at Gross Point South High School tonight. Just two months after pictures featuring students and the N-word showed up on Instagram, a video of white students saying derogatory things about blacks is posted online. Let's get to Jason Colthorpe. He's live in Gross Point tonight. And Jason, this is pretty hard to watch. Nothing good about this video, Carmen, exactly right. And the language is repugnant, and it's a story, unfortunately, we've told before. This time, though, the school is taking the extra step not just to identify these students, which it has, and punish them, but also to alert all the parents and students about what has happened and to let them know that bigotry like this has a long way to go before it's ended at this high school. Oh, segregated. They get, they get made. North South Dakota. This video making the rounds on social media is turning stomachs for the racist language used by three Gross Point South students. Send them back to Africa or the slaves, one of the two options. One student doing most of the talking refers to injuring and killing black people and uses words like worthless and segregation and much more that isn't worth repeating. Awful to be owned by white people and white people are to be the dominance of the country. We're going to burn them on snakes. Today a letter went home to parents from the school's principal calling the video deplorable. It says the students could be suspended or expelled and this video reaffirms the need for a continued effort to educate students on diversity, inclusion, and race relations. Um, you put like, like a pole with those, like, those little burning things at the end and stab them so you can know who the owner is. At it's least so one parent commenting on this video is pushing to see that those responsible aren't allowed to walk at graduation. I spoke to one parent tonight who is outraged by this, but she declined to go on camera out of fear for her kids. That incident we mentioned that happened in March where some students wrote the N-word on themselves and then posted it on Instagram. Uh, after that, she says one of the students talked to the media about that and some students singled them out, bullied them, and called them a snitch after that incident. We're live in Gross Point tonight, Jason Coulthorpe, Local 4. Jason, do we know how other students are reacting to this video? Yes, uh, Carmen, I did talk to the principal tonight, mm -hmm. and he says uh, that they, uh, like we said, identified these kids. Uh, he's taking the extra steps. He's having a press conference tomorrow. But students know about this video. Many of them have seen that, and a lot of them have come forward to the administration just to say that they found this disgusting and they want something done about it. All Carmen. right. We'll continue to cover it. Our Jason Colthorpe reporting for us live.